Angry Birds game, I had to download this. Make an account. Practice. No money. I'm not spending a single penny in your in your terrible game. What are you doing? You know what I want to do? If only I can actually install this app from the app. I would like that a lot more. Can't wait to get to the casino! Oh, that when I move it, it moves the reflection. Start now, please. Or maybe never. Because I don't... Should have been its own app. The odd thing is I don't even have to win the level. Having a single is terrible. Great job. Oh, that was not a great job. Pigs lived. Good. Not another player. You're not even playing against real people. Oh my no. No. No, screw you. I don't want to pay money. Yeah, pay for cash. It summarizes this entire terrible app. Turning legal to illegal.
because I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the medium. I'm gonna do the easy. I'm gonna be done. I'm gonna be done with this app because this is stupid. It's the new Angry Birds game. You have to make an account to play it. It's not even worth it. It was in his loading bar is probably fake. Just I don't like this. I don't like this. We wait three years for a new legitimate Angry Birds game. Oh, what do we get? Some stupid thing in someone else's stupid app. Not only that, but there's no there's no fun to it. Because it was because first of all, no one would respond like that. Plus no one would actually type words. It would have just been emojis trying to say, You're a first timer, screw you, kill yourself written in emojis. That's what I would have thought if it was a real player, I would have seen that. Instead of like Oh no, you saw my future video ideas. No! This is what I think of your game. This is what I think of your terrible, terrible thing. Yes, get this out of here and keep it away. I don't care if they have the new Angry Birds game in there. I tried it. It wasn't good. It was somehow worse than Angry Birds 2. In every way possible. Like, how do you... Like, how do we... Like, at least Angry Birds 2 had, like, levels to play. I didn't say, oh, it was like, you want to play through all the liver packs, pay money to play at once, and you won't win. Pay more money. Okay, you want to quit? Oh, here you go. Oh, here you go. Here's the equivalent of what casinos do. No thanks. I quit while I started because it crashed. It wasn't worth it. It actually was not worth it. Would have played the other ones, but I don't care. Why? Why did Robbie have to put the next game in this and there? Why? It's just stupid. It was kind of fun. Sad thing is that, is that I want a legitimate Angry Birds game. Not an Angry Birds game thrown into another game. There was a new update for Bloom's TD5. That's probably going to be infinitely more enjoyable. Mainly because it's not telling me to pay like 85 cents for the minimum real fake tournament. It's not even real people. Because that message looked fake. Plus, it didn't show me going against someone else. It was like, username's not available. That was probably fake, because... They probably, someone inputs a username, then they block that username from being used. I think that's how it works. The Steward Plants vs. Zombies educational thing was better. Mainly because I wasn't risking it by playing. Oh, well. There is our thing. What was this added?
Yo, let's try this dumb challenge thing out. I'm not gonna be fast tracking any ones. I'm like the save. Kind of afraid of what that save was. All this is, is you play a level, and you get more rewards than usual. Great update! Wasn't even a good update. Also, I was thinking of why Bloom TD6 is delayed. They're still pumping out content for the 5th game. When will the 6th game come out? That was the new Angry Birds game and the new Balloon CD5 update. Both, I don't know which one was worse. Because, all the Balloon CD5 update did was just give you more reward, awards within a certain time frame. All the new Angry Birds game was, was something in a gambling app that was also licensed. And not to mention, I find it stupid. For one reason, and that reason would sadly have to be, literally, why, why, I don't know why I find it so stupid, and just so terribly bad, that would actually have to be for one reason, and one reason only. Because, both didn't bring anything new. Because, we already have Angry Birds friends for the competitive competition. Sad thing is that Rovio actually tried there. They messed up. Again. Again. After the terrible idea of matching games. They had the good idea to make it gambling. First of all, no one would be able to play it. Because it's ages 17 and up. Is what the app was rated. I didn't care because the new Angry Birds game was in there. I didn't even attain to spend one cent. One cent rattles. You can do one cent fake PvP. I don't want that. I tried the zero cent one. The harder zero cent PvP. And that didn't work. Probably because I had no credit card to access. It's just, I don't know at this point. I don't know. Like, when I first found out about it, I'm like, oh, a new game! Then I'm like, oh, that's what it is. I went from me being excited to me being mad at Ro not only mad at Rovio, disappointed at Rovio, and just flat out hating them all together. Just, just, just asking for money. So think about, like, you can bet at, like, $150,000. No one wants that. No one wants that. It just gives them money. It just gives them money. It's so bad. It will never launch. I've tried over a hundred times yesterday. Yeah, the 2D revolution thing. It's not gonna launch. Come on, I just want to see what it is. Emulators don't exist, so just let me launch it. It's not on Android, I checked. Also, why Rovia? Why Ninja Kiwi? Why digital chocolate size a minute? What kind of a company name even is that? 
Like, I've seen some pretty dumb company names in my day, like Game Salad, which just feels like they're using random assets. The Garbage Side of Unity. And other things. But in the end, all they really need to do is stop making stuff. Oh wait, Apple forced them to stop making stuff because they didn't update all their apps to be compatible with 8.0. Even though the majority of them still allow you just have to click a lot. Like, just if you click enough times, it'll open. Trust me. Except you won't trust me. I'll be giving away a one billion dollar insurance gift card so you can play the new Angry Birds game to your heart's content unless it unless it just straight up rips from your credit card. I don't know what I don't want to know.